line. Nick Stevens out of the shotgun. Quick throw to the wide side of the field. Gallup, 73 catches on the season now. There's Stevens. You look at his numbers. 65.5% completion rate. Almost 1,500 yards. But after that uh, demotion to the bench, he has just been a different guy. Well, the, those are the efficiency numbers you're talking about. Winding down. Just does get the snap off. He's a little bit of room to run for it. It closes quickly. It'll be close to the first down. Stevens will throw, and that one is picked off at the 40-yard line. Jason Jordan with the interception. Watch Jordan. He's right here, number four, and he's just going to watch the eyes of the quarterback. Stevens coming off the play-action fake, and you see him dropping right underneath that route. Trying to get the ball to Ola B.C. Johnson. It's over 800 yards rushing this year, three touchdowns. Stevens will throw, and his receiver, Johnson. Kerger instead of a critique. Some more play action. Stevens to the sideline. Dietrich Clark makes the catch, unfortunately, for. Where well, they've got their defensive tackles and ends swapping responsibilities. Quick snap, high throw. It's incomplete. No flags. Four-man rush. Pass caught at the 30-yard line. That'll be good enough for a first down. Of course, when your safety's making that many plays in the run game. Quick snap. Stevens over the middle, wide open, has his man. Johnson to the end zone. Touchdown. Colorado's this contest. From the 25-yard line. Stevens will shoulder fake. He'll air it out. Well, that's got to be caught. Well, 71 on the season. Almost a one-handed grab on the near. Harking him back to his quarterback days. Boy, Idaho playing some inspired defense. Anderson and in Stevens, five out of ten through the air. will throw it again. The slant. Hits his target, Michael Gallup. They brought pressure. Kind of a unique defensive front look that time. Gallup by himself. It's an answer with a score. Under throw and looking for Gallup again. Their pressure packages. They're showing pressure again here. They'll bring some heat. Stevens high with the throw. Play clock down to one, but the snap was off just in time, and the pass is caught. They're flying around. Paul Petrino said it coming out of half. Over the middle. Incomplete. But watch number 50. See him bail and run. That ball a little bit. Was Kevin Shell? That pass is dropped in every facet. On third down, Stevens near side and Dawkins. I'll be asking a lot of that. Dukes, Grayson Allen right now, the basketball player, having some issues. Deep throw, pass caught. That one goes. 54-yard line, a 47-yard pickup. The last one was a post from the right side of the formation, this time from the left side. Same coverage, same guy, D.J. Hampton. Hey, see if it ignites that Ram sideline. Here's Stevens. Another throw to Johnson, and he holds on at the 20-yard line. Gain a toll from the seven. No play fake it. Stevens rolling right. Back across the middle, touchdown. They're going to say incomplete, dropped it, got it. You see Stevens coming around, gets that ball, hits Wosu right in the hands. Now, did he have possession long enough? And he didn't come through with the catch. Yeah, you see it right there as he went down to the turf, that ball was... It's second and goal. Boy, Stevens hit as he lets it go, and there's your touchdown. Michael Gallup. It's been a very quiet night for Michael Gallup. Able to finally get into the end zone. 
Nick Stevens pays a pretty high price for that touchdown. Lupe Manu once again, another pressure. He levels the passer for the Colorado State Rams and Nick Stevens. Started the game strong, a couple of nice runs. Stevens up top, wide open. Ola B.C. Johnson will take it to the end zone. 73 yards. There are no... Watch Johnson. He's just going to run a go route. Not ready. You see there, looking in the backfield, D.J. Hampton. He's been on Johnson all game long. And every big pass is where no cleats are really breaking him off. Over the middle. Gallup bobbles it but holds on, breaks a tackle, and he will take it to the end zone. Goodness gracious, back and forth we go. He's taking shots, one after the other. And this is what most anticipated. I know we certainly did coming into this game from the Colorado State offense, getting that ball to Michael Gallup, and he shows guys that is Miles Garrett or Derek Barnett, are those, guys, are those guys stupid for playing in the game? I would say no. Miles Garrett does not strike the situation from a year ago, obviously, an injury in a bowl game cost him. The draft status drops to the side. I think it's safe. I also think it's selfish. I don't know that there's negative connotations. There are times to be selfish. But uh, people take an exception to that description. That's First at the line. Foul. Roughing the passer. Defense, number 97. 15-yard penalty. Automatic first down. Akeem Coleman with a late shot on Stevens. Coleman's the newcomer of the year, the Sun Belt Conference. I don't know. Maybe it was the finish or something. Number 97. Stevens slinging toward the end zone and incomplete but i'm with you I and you have that same injury you might not even get drafted after that so who is it that really is at risk at that point is it just the top end guys or is it those guys that could have this could potentially have good or, for good or for bad the idea that it's unique to just those guys is lost on me boy there's some big hits going that is on a shot. is he back? i have more i have an opinion on the commentary more so than i do the decision there's a nice grab of the end zone by Michael to pick this one out of the air. Give him a chance to make a play. We've seen this work on the other side. We get these contested throws. There's some contact prior to the ball arriving right off the. That one is batted in the air and incomplete. Second down and 10 coming up. Game. But another really talented defender for the Vandals. Stevens, and that one is picked off back at the 20-yard line. Had a tough night at times in coverage. Old BC Johnson getting past him on a number of occasions, but this time ball underthrown. Hampton looked like he lost track of where it was initially, turned back and was able to backtrack and come up with that interception. That's something that this Idaho defense has been phenomenal at. All season he's come open. Next thing you know, that name starts popping up for other jobs. Stevens over the middle and another catch by Johnson. Let's go down to a Coach Bobo. I asked Coach Bobo if Stafford ever talks to Nick Stevens or the other quarterbacks, and he said no, but they do watch his tape and their jaws drop at the things Stafford did in college. Yeah, and I think to follow that up is they said don't. After the onside kick recovery, Stevens will continue to throw it in. As Johnson again, who is dancing around on the slick surface, staying on his feet. And he'll be tackled out of bounds around the 15. You're not going to paint an accurate depiction of how this game has unfolded. The slant pass is caught. Down around the two-yard line. It'll be first and goal for Colorado State. Stevens will throw, and... That's a defense. Oh, there's... Defense, number two, automatic first down. Dietrich. 
Stevens trying to go for two here. The throw to the end zone, and that one is caught. But Olabisi Johnson.